Welcome to Blonde Cards and Crafts. Let's make something together. Hello crafters and welcome to my channel if you're new here. Welcome back if you're a subscriber. Today we're going to have a look at this. It's the Paper Craft Society box and this box is box number 45. And I have had a look inside it already. It's by Tony Darrick and there's some lovely stamps and dies in here as well as lots more. So I'm going to leave what's inside the tissue paper and the book for a moment. And what we'll do is we'll focus on what comes inside the wallet. I love the colours. It's looking quite red in my camera, but it's a very, very pink. It's like a fuchsia pink or a hot pink um, in real life. So now in the wallet, we get three pouches. We have some dies, some stamps and some pattern paper. Now I took the dies out. The dies usually come on a clear plastic sheet. There's double sided tape behind them and they're stuck on. But this is what I do when I get my dies. I put a piece of magnetic sheet onto a piece of 300 GSM cardstock and then I put them inside these Q-Connect wallets. So we got some sentiment dies as well as this large die, which you can see here is going to die cut out this floral. And we got two leaves. Now, these four dies make up two sentiments and I've already die cut them out so you could see. So we have the shadow die, which is the background here, as well as the word die itself. And the sentiment here is how you doing? Isn't that so cute? I love it. Makes me think of Joey from Friends. How you doing? So that's one of them. So that's this one and this one here makes up that one. And then this is the shadow and this is the word for this one. And it has love you more. And I thought they were lovely dies to have in our stash. So the stamps you can see here, we get this large sprig and we have a die to cut that out. We have two lovely leaf um, stamps as well. And I think these two will stamp, will die cut those out. And then we have lots of sentiments. We have thanks. How you doing? A cheeky hello. I love that. Have a fantastic day. Let's do this. You had me at high. Then we have love you more. You are very special to me. And have I ever told you? Aren't they fab sentiments? I love them. Great stash builders. Really happy with them. And again, these come on a plastic sheet. Um, they're sandwiched actually between two plastic sheets. And what I do is put the back one onto some 300 GSM cardstock and then um, pop them in a wallet. So these two will sit on a shelf in on my bookcase behind me when I'm not using them. I find that's handy then I can rifle through them all and pick out any stamp or die that I want to use. And then we have some pattern paper and we have six sheets. So we have this lovely one. It's like um, a paint splotches, really lovely kind of a watercolor. Then we have a background color that goes with it. We have this green one and then a background sheet in the green. And then we have this one, which is black and white. And then the background is in the pink, very similar to the pink that we get um, color that's on the wallet. And you actually have a better look of the pink color. The wallet is the same color, more or less as this just picks up differently on the camera. So they're the six pieces of pattern paper um, that we get in the wallet. So I'm going to fold these up and we're going to have a look at what comes inside the box. So we get our little booklet or magazine. We also get some tissue paper and I love keeping the tissue paper. I use floral or flower dyes on tissue paper. I layer it up a number of times, put my dye on top, die cut it out. And then I, I, you know, kind of use a ball tool and they make the most beautiful flowers when you use tissue paper. So I'm going to quickly unwrap this and see what comes inside. So now we get a sparkle pen 
and these are really easy to use you just take off the ring twist it closed and then as you twist it it pierces and then give it a good shake to get all your sparkle up and then you can use that then to embellish sentiments i have some spectrum noir ones in my stash but i will definitely use this never have enough i'm actually due to order some new ones with craft stash so that's really handy to have we get what sounds like sequins and i'm going to just take a scissors to this and see what's in here very carefully I don't want to open it too much because then I'll have sequins gone everywhere. So let's have a look. We really do get quite a lot of sequins. These are lovely. They're like a silver, a shiny silver sequin. They're actually clear, but they look silver. Very, very cool. Great for making shaker cards or just embellishing a card. I love using sequins for doing that so that's really cool we also get a couple of sheets of this looks like watercolor cardstock and these pieces have got a very faint outline of an image on them so i think it's to encourage you to do some watercoloring so we have one of these so there's two of those we have this large floral image, one of those. This is lovely. Nice to stamp a sentiment in there. And this one has a square here, so you can stamp your sentiment in there. I hope you can see it all right in the light. It's very dull, dark day today here in Ireland on the West Coast. It's lashing raining. And it's cold and it's July, but it's cold. Um, we have another big floral image there and another one of the first three. So we get three of this image. Well, that's what I've got. Three of that image and then four other images. So seven sheets there all together and our sparkle pen. So this is Tony. Hello, Tony. And inside you get um, your download as a Papercraft Society member. You'll be able to download and print off your pattern papers if you wish. There's lots of inspiration in this booklet and it tells you here what comes in your box. And then there's lots of projects for you with colouring using your pattern papers, chatting with Tony. Really lovely. I wouldn't call myself a colorist now by no means. Lots of great inspiration there for us with this one. So that's it. That is our Paper Craft Society box 45 i'm just going to put out everything now that we have gotten in the kit so there's everything that we got in the kit from our watercolor paper with ready stamped images our dies our stamps our pattern paper our lovely little um, glitter pen our sequins lots in this kit for us to get on with and don't forget you can download the pattern papers and be inspired by the lovely um cards and makes inside the booklet so that's it now for this uh paper craft society unboxing thanks for watching and i'll see you again soon bye for now